everyone welcome back to my channel or if you are new here then a very big welcome to you and I really hope you enjoy my channel. So today's video is a huge homeware haul. So I've got things from three shops. I've got some things from Dunelm, some things from the range and also a few bits from Asda. So I've just put them all together to make one homeware haul. Lots of nice, affordable, uh, yeah, I'd say affordable, um, neutral decor. So like I always say, if you want to continue to watch, then grab your drinks and your snacks and um, let's get into the haul. So I'm on my black coffee because I'm still fasting till 12 o'clock. So I'm fasting between the hours of 7pm at night and 12 o'clock the following day just to try and keep my weight uh, stable. So I don't want to put the, the bit of weight that I've lost, I don't want to put it back on. So I've got my Disneyland Paris mug. Um, we bought this a couple of years ago. Um, yeah, and I love it absolutely stunning love a bit of disney i'll have to apologize for the state of me today i've got no makeup on <laughs> uh so you know but i know you're used to it if you're a regular here i don't i i quite often don't have any makeup on these videos you know i like to keep it real so yeah i hope i'm not uh i'm not scaring you too much this morning so let me have a sip of my coffee and we'll start with asda because they're the ones nearest to me right so asda first so these, um, I bought three things from Asda, but two of them are the same. So I'll obviously just show you the one. These are from the Stacey Solomon range. Um, I do think she has some lovely bits in her range at Asda. Um, I, I have had some bits from her range before. I bought a beaded tray uh, that's on my ladder shelf upstairs in our bedroom. That was her range. She always has nice, my kind of style um, things in her range. So I bought two dog bowls. These were eight pounds each, like I say, from uh, the Stacey Solomon range. And they are just these beautiful white um, dog bowls. So I've got two, like I say, they've got the paw prints on and she does a lot of this with the little beading around the top, the tray that I've just mentioned, that's got this beading around the top. So picked up um, two of those for our cockapoo Bentley. And um, yeah, they were eight pounds each. And to go with that, because his bowls are getting a bit grubby and so his, his mat that his bowls go on. So to go with the two bowls, I thought I can't have those beautiful bowls on his skanky old, <laughs> skanky old place mat. So I bought a new one. Again, from her range. How cute is this? It's molting though. It's all over my black leggings. <laughs> How cute is this dog mat? And the bowls just fit perfectly side by side on it. Just lovely. I love the um, shape of it. Again, with the scalloped edges. Um, a lot of her things have got the scalloped edging um, as well as the beading. And just, yeah, neutral, nice uh, brownie colour around the edge. And this was £6. So not too bad. I mean, I know you can get them cheaper than that. But we keep his uh, bowls in the utility room. So I just thought that would look really nice in there and in keeping um, with the neutral decor we've got. So next I will move on to um, the range. Right, let me just drag me and get, I've got my receipts as well so I can tell you the prices of everything. Right, I've got three things from the range, but again, two of them are the same, so I'll only show you one. So, bought two of these jute floor mats. Now, I'm really pleased with these. These were 9 99 and we have got a rug in here that's from Dunelm, and I've also got a doormat that's from Dunelm um, that are very similar to this, and I needed two new indoor doormats for our side door in our kitchen and our patio doors in our kitchen. And I wanted something neutral that's going to go with the rest of the decor. So got these two from the range. 9 99 which I don't think is bad for a jute doormat, um, floor mat like that. Um, obviously, you know, I love all the neutral decor. So this is right up my street. If anybody's interested in this size, it's 45 by 75 centimetres. And I just like the edging on it with these um, little, uh, I don't know what you call them, little bits at the side, the edging. So picked up two of those from the range. And then the next thing that I got 
um, that we got from the range is this um, photo frame. So this will go really well in our bedroom because we've got some dark wood in there and we've also got all our photo frames have got um, black frames. All our pictures have got black frames. So I thought this would go really nice. So it says um, metal and wood effect multi-frame. The picture size is six by four. And yeah, I just liked that. And it was only £12.99. I'm sure it was. Yeah, £12.99, which I don't think is a bad price for that. Um, I think that's a, a good little buy from the range for twelve ninety nine. I mean, I think B and M, Primark, everywhere is putting the prices up anyway. Um, some of the um, like decor bits in B and M, I think, have gone up, like their vases and things. Um, so you know, everything's going up, isn't it? But I think that's a good price for thirteen quid. So got that also from the range. So I'm really pleased with that. Put some photos of uh, the kids in that. Put that on the wall. And then the last shop that I've got uh, things from is Dunelm. Let me just put all those things down. Um, so you might have seen my Dun uh, Dunelm come shop with me. That was my last video. If you didn't, then if you want to check it out, I'll link. I always link some videos below in the description box so you can find them easily. So I'll link the Dunelm one if you want to check out the come shop with me there. And they had some really nice um, things in there. I could have gone mad. I'm trying not to spend ridiculous amounts. I'm only really trying to get what what I really, really want or need. Um, but yeah, they did have some lovely things in there, some lovely garden um, items. Obviously, it's that time of year, isn't it, when we're tarting up our gardens. And I will be doing a garden um, haul at some point because we need some new things for our garden. Um, so that will definitely be coming up at some point on my channel. But yeah, they had some lovely things in there. Lots of um, nice bathroom stuff, I thought. Loads of nice storage. But anyway, so that's done, Elm. So let's go on to what I got from there. So the first thing I got was this notebook. I love a notebook. <laughs> I love a list. I'm a bit like notebooks as I am with mugs. Can never have too many notebooks. You can never have too many mugs, in my opinion. I just, yeah, um, I go a little bit mad for those two items. So I just liked this and I wanted something neutral. <laughs> How many times can I say neutral in this video? Um, I wanted something neutral um, because I'm going to have it in here. This is our living room where I mostly film or our lounge, whatever you want to call it. And if you saw a few videos ago, um, I did a Poundland haul and I bought a wooden tray with gold handles and I needed something to style it up. I've got a gold pen already, so I'm going to keep this on my tray. Um, it's just a, a lined notebook, so this will be <laughs> writing my to-do list because I love a I love a to-do list. I love to cross it off. That feeling of satisfaction. Is anybody the same, <laughs> or is it just me? Am I just a bit sad? Um, I love that satisfaction of writing a list in the morning of your jobs and ticking them off. Though there is some jobs that always get carried over to the next day. Are you the same? <laughs> There's those jobs that you really don't want to do that just get carried over for like weeks at a time. <laughs> but yeah, so anyway, I'm digressing again. You know, I love to I love to digress. So this should have been three pounds and they did have it in different sizes as well. Let me just bend down so I can get my receipt. Um, now, can I see that without my glasses? Hold on. So it should have been three pounds, but there was in the sale and it was. I don't know whether it was that much cheaper, to be fair. Uh, A5 spiral notebook pamper. So yeah, pamper grass on it. £1.50. So half price was the notebook. So that's not bad, is it, for £1.50? I just like the look of it and it's useful as well. So I'm going to style that up, like I say, on the tray um, with a gold pen that I've already got that goes with the gold handle. <laughs> you have to think about the little fine details sometimes. So got that. And then also to style up that same tray, obviously all from Dunelm, is this candle. Now, I can't smell, as if you are regular here, you will know, I have no, no sense of smell whatsoever. And I haven't been able to smell since before Harvey was born, and he's 20. So I'd say 21, 22 years, I have no smell. Um, it's all to do with my polyps and my sinuses. If, you, if you're regular here, you'll know, so I won't go into it all. But basically, I, I can't smell. So I don't know what this smells like, this candle, but I was told... <laughs> by my husband that it smelt nice. I can't get the lid off it. Wow, that 
that's that's a bit tough um so apparently it smells nice but it is just this candle and i just liked it because i just thought it looked really nice white um cream color i liked the fact that it had a lid um because i don't like to see candles not really when they're for show <laughs> I don't like to see them. They gather dust, don't they, all around here. And they look a bit manky when you start burning them. So I just thought with a nice lid, it'll just keep it really nice. Like I say, because I do want it for, for more decorative pur purposes rather than anything else. And I just really like that. Now, I don't think this actually was particularly cheap. It's from the Dorma range. It says Luxury Fragrance Candle Coastal Stroll Stroll lasts up to 40 hours and i think that was 12 pounds so i mean i don't know whether that's let me oh, it up there i don't know whether that's cheap or not for a candle i don't buy a lot of candles because i can't smell it just depresses me a little bit to think that they're smelling nice and i can't smell them but it was 12 pounds but like i say i'm not really going to be burning it anyway it's just for for looking nice so 12 pounds for that and then next thing from Donnell, I bought these eucalyptus, faux eucalyptus sprays. These were £2.25 per stem. And I think I bought four. Yeah, I bought four. So these are to go in a vase that I've got um, upstairs on our little table. We've got some pampas grass in there. Um, but it was quite cheap pampas grass. It's that kind of style and it just doesn't um, stand right and it is molting all the time. I'm forever dusting the little table that the vase is on. So I wanted some greenery as well. So the two reasons I was fed up of it molting. It doesn't look great and I wanted some greenery up there. So I bought these four eucalyptus sprays. I love a bit of eucalyptus. I love a faux plant or a faux flower. Um, yeah, I'm not good with the real with real plants. Um, so I just thought they will add something nice to the landing. And for 2 25 it's not really bad, I don't think. I don't know. I mean, I don't know how much these things go for. I would think it's about at least that, isn't it? Um, so, yeah, I'm really pleased with those um, that eucalyptus as well from there. And then the last thing in today's haul, I think, in my opinion... I've possibly saved the best till last, though I do love that dog mat and those dog bowls. <laughs> small things, you know, amuse small minds, they say, don't they? Uh, but yeah, I absolutely love this. Now, this is going to be a bit heavy for me to lift up on camera. It is quite a large mirror. This is also for our bedroom, and you'll see why, because it'll match in a minute. Are we going to say the, the N word again? The neutral word again. I bought, oh God, it's heavy. I bought this mirror, so you might be able to see all my setup in it. Um, but yeah, I got this um, mirror. So this was sixty pounds, and they also had this in a large um, rectangle mirror. If you don't like the round, but you like it and you wanted the re a rectangle one, that was also sixty pound. So as you can see, it's got the black frame. So like I was saying with the photo frame earlier, it's got the black edging that will match um, with my other photos up there. And it's got the dark um, wood. And we've got some um, of this wood panelling behind our TV on the wall in our bedroom. And it's a very similar colour to this. And this looks like it with it having the ridges on. Looks like the panelling. So I think it will go really nice in there. It is a big size. Um, does it say that? Does it say the size anywhere? So I'll put like the diameter of it. No, I don't think it does. Um, but yeah, as you can see, anyway, that it is big. I don't want to drop it. Don't think it says the like the diameter of it. I don't think. We put my glasses on. See if it says in the smallest writing you've ever seen. I, don't you hate it when they put really small writing on things and you can't even see them sometimes with your glasses on. Right, it says a Bryant, it's called Bryant Round Mirror, if you want to Google it or, or look at it on the website, whatever, 70 centimetres. So it is large, as you can see, but I'm really chuffed to bits with that and can't wait to get that up in our, um, in our bedroom. So I'm just adding this bit of video in because I nearly forgot to show you our new bar store. So we've bought three of them to go um, um, with our breakfast bar in the kitchen. So I'll turn you around and show you them. So here they are with Bentley as well. <laughs> Hello, Bentley. 
Do you want to be filmed? Oh, good boy. Um, so these are the bar stores. So my husband found them um, online from a company called Atlantic Shopping. Bentley thinks it's all about him, look. And now I'm trying to show the stores. So more people interested in you. Yes, I bet they are. <laughs> but anybody who is interested in the bar stores, here they are from Atlantic Shopping. Um, yeah, we just wanted to um, get some new ones. Yes, I know you want fuss now, don't you? So we just wanted to get some new ones because the other ones had gone really, they'd like started to rip on the back. Um, all the chrome bit on the bottom of them was messed up. Let me fuss you then. Um, so yeah, we needed some new ones. Um, so we liked these because obviously the white, so they go with the kitchen because all the kitchen's white and um, the wooden bits on them. So yeah, I just wanted to include those in the video as well. And here's Bentley again, because it's all about you, isn't it, Bentley? Of course it is. <laughs> Good boy. So I hope you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, click the like button. If you'd like to follow me over on Instagram, it's Emma Louise YT is uh, my name over on, on there. If you want to follow me on there, I do film quite a lot of stories on there. Um, a lot of waffle. If you like to hear me waffle, you'd like me, I like my stories over on Instagram. I've got lots of things coming up on my channel. Um, like I say, I'll have a garden haul. I've got a home bargains and a B and M haul. I'm going to go to Home Sense to do a come shot with me there because that's being requested. I always try and film the videos that you request. Um, I've got some brand collaborations coming up. Um, I want to order some things off Timu actually, so I will have another Timu haul coming up. So yeah, there's a few things in the pipeline. So if any of that is of interest to you, then make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out. And I will see you all in the next video. Take care of yourselves. Bye.